Good morning, everybody. Fell back with a question, more a asking for advice, for help from the YouTube community regarding Borderlands 3. Now, you saw my uh, video with Moe's, got a build that shreds, um, but I'm struggling with flak. Did a bit of research, and pretty much my skill tree is a sort of killer six type skill tree, and it's, it's nothing special. It's a standard gamma burst build here um, equipment at the moment I run and this is where I need help I'd like to find a failsafe or something old guard I've got a front loader at the moment farmed uh, Captain Bean or Sergeant Bean or whatever it was um, f and managed to get a fairly decent one surge grenades super happy with it 25% increased damage for 6 seconds that one works very well and I've got a pull not a great pull, and I'd, I'd like an auto idle, and I need to find a better red fang. 29% weapon damage, 12% mully one damage. So you'll see most of my weapon tree is mully one. I've got a flipper at the moment, stock flipper. Action skill is active 200%. Active is 200%, and gamma burst gains 150 bonus. So. At the moment, I'm really looking for a better auto idle, something that's got magazine capacity size because a lot of those weapons run out of ammo very, very quickly. <coughs> the, the, I'm struggling with this build. Everybody has said go shotguns. I find it incredibly frustrating. I found I've farmed Genevieve, and and I'd like to show you quickly the problem that we're facing. So let us travel to the planet of Athena's where every youtuber shows their uh, builds yay let's imitate everybody else like there's anything original on YouTube yep. Yep. but I kind of need to show you the problem with the build I'd like to show you the issues I'm having with the build survivability for some reason is a, a big problem I don't know if it's maybe the surge grenades that explode on me, um, but I used to have a little level 57 failsafe old god. Excuse me quickly while I just sell off some junk, restock on ammo. I had a 57 uh, failsafe old god, I think it was, and it was a really good shield. I have not seen it drop. I don't know if it's specific um, to Zarolagos, whatever you call the planet, uh, for DLC 2. Um, but that's part of the frustration here. Um, I suppose if you're patient, this build that I'm running at the moment can work. But I'm used to Moe's absolutely shredding. And I'm 100% sure Flak is capable of more. Um, I know Flak isn't the most... Uh, we're going to say the most OP character, the best character to play. Everybody's playing. Um, so one of the other characters at the moment, um, Moxie, for example, has got a ton of Zane builds out and Amara builds. Amara is super, super strong. I like Flak as a character. You know, I like his sayings, etc., etc. <laughs> the, the jokes and so on. But as you can see, it's it's not that strong. Um, and it's a little bit frustrating trying to do. There's no way that I'm doing the takedown, or the Malewan takedown with this with this build. I wouldn't survive all, uh, five seconds. And as you can see, quickly, fairly easily went down there. It's not as strong as it should be, and that's where I'm asking. Please, dear YouTube viewers, the 10 or 15 people that might view this, help a brother out. Where is a fairly easy boss to farm the Felsurf Old God? Where do I farm the Red Fang? And where do I get a, a decent idol, auto idol? I know you have to farm. What's that? Ah, uh, oh, the last boss. But she goes through a bunch of phases, and that annoys me. So please leave a comment if you know where I can farm some of the better loot. Um, not just Graveward, etc. And it would be much appreciated. And uh, we'll speak to you soon. Cheers.